Hey guys, Steve back with you here at Pleasant Ranch. Today we're going to build this walnut coffee table. It's got this little drawer with a bow tie shaped drawer pull, and then inside an unexpected pop of color. My favorite part of this coffee table is how the wood grain is continuous through the drawer front. So I have my pattern here that I drew up in Illustrator. There's an eighth inch reveal here. Uh, so that's where I'm going to make my cut and then I'll clean up both the inside and the outside of the, of the gap here on the sander. We're gonna put some spray glue on this thing, glue it down and then cut it out on the scroll saw.
world. So I guess it was only a matter of time before this guy gave up the ghost. I've had this DeWalt Random Orbit for about three years, and it's been it's been good. You know, it's a little bit um, a little bit harsh as far as vibrations and noise go. Uh, so that just finally died on me, and uh, just replaced it with this guy. This is a Merca Deros Sander. This thing is sweet. So my finishing process for this table is uh, the same one I use on a lot of furniture that I make. Uh, just standard wipe-on poly, which is a thinned uh, polyurethane. It comes pre-thinned, and I just rub that on with a rag, let it dry, and then I float some 400 grit sandpaper on it uh, between coats, and then reapply until I'm happy with the finish I've built up. And then to finish it all off, I just rub on a little bit of paste wax uh, with some 4 aught steel wool. And um, I'm not going to go into all the detail on the finishing process on this video because I've already done that in my farm table refinish video, which I will leave a link to in the description. Thanks a lot for watching and make sure you hit that subscribe button.